Hello everybody, my name is Paul Ainsworth, talking to you today from Mahe, our cookery school here in Padstow. So, legendary chef and good friend Tom Akins has asked me if I could cook a dish in five minutes for an amazing charity called Only a Pavement Away. Now, Only a Pavement Away is supporting the homeless and getting them off the streets and back into work. Now, a lot of these homeless people are from the hospitality industry and it's the first time they've been homeless. So along with Tom and myself and all of the other videos that have gone on to Instagram, we're all doing our best to try and raise as much money as we can. So what's the premise? We're gonna cook a dish, or I'm gonna cook a dish in five minutes. I'm gonna nominate five people. And if you and I could donate five pounds to this charity or whatever you can, that would be absolutely brilliant. So what are we cooking? A steak sandwich in five minutes. Now it's a bit of a tall order, but I like being under pressure, and um, I'm not a great multitasker, so I won't be talking to you a lot in this one, but it should be interesting to watch, because I am gonna be in the weeds. So we've got a sirloin steak, what we call a minute steak. So again, cooked in about a minute, so we can rest it. In the same pan, I'm gonna roast off some onions. So I've got a couple of red onions, probably only gonna use one. Some mayonnaise and some mustard, thyme and garlic, bit of blue cheese and watercress. So we're gonna make a delicious sandwich and we're gonna griddle our bread. Right, timer, you set it five minutes. Why am I nervous about this? <laughs> I just wanna hit this in one take. Right, okay, pan is nice and hot, griddle is nice and hot. Three, two, one, five minutes, away we go. Okay, so we're gonna season the steak. Salt and pepper all over. Little bit of oil on the steak, not on the pan, because we want a really nice hot sear, and we want to get that caramelized as quick as possible so we can get it out resting. Season, again, twist the pepper, steak's cooking. Now, bread, we want to get that nice and griddled. Okay, we're gonna take a little bit of garlic on there. Okay, put a little bit of thyme over the bread. Rub that on there, so again, loads of lovely flavour. And get that griddling and toasting. While our steak's cooking, we're gonna take one onion, cut the root off from the back. Nice and fine, okay? So we just wanna get to soak up all that flavour from the steak into our onions, all right? Just break them up so we've got lovely, nice, proper, thin, fried onions. While that's happening, a little bit of English mustard into our mayonnaise. All right, and we're, gonna, we're not gonna use butter, we're gonna put the mayonnaise, that lovely, beautiful mustard mayonnaise on our toast when it comes out. I absolutely love griddled bread, so just have a look at that. Turn that over, yes, beautiful. Nice and toasted. How are we looking for time? Four minutes just gone. Turn our steak over, look at that. Okay, so that's cooking nice and fast. I'm gonna turn that heat up. Our toast, lovely. Right, I'm gonna leave that, move that steak onto there. Touch more oil into the pan. Leave the pan on. You're loving this, isn't you, CC? <laughs> I hope it's good, isn't it? I hope it's exciting. Season in the onions. We'll take a little bit more garlic, nice and thin, into the onions. Some pepper. Two minutes, just gone. Saute those onions round. Touch more oil. Just nice fried onions. Our toast, beautiful. Our steak, look at that, lovely. Out, let that rest. Keep moving those onions around so they're nice and fried. Our mayonnaise is ready for our sandwich. Steak is resting nicely. At this stage, I'm just going to take a little bit of time for the onions. Two minutes left. 
can it be done? So look at those. How quickly those will caramelise up, taking all that lovely flavour from the steak, the seasoning, okay? So just leave them to do their thing. <laughs> right, we're going to take a nipple bit of that blue cheese, and we're just going to crumble that up when we come to doing our sandwich. I'm using here beautiful bark and blue, okay? Onions are cooking nicely. Right, mayonnaise. Nice and liberal with that mayonnaise. So you're kind of using that instead of the butter. Onions, quick final taste of those. Lovely, beautifully seasoned, nice and meaty. Little bit of bite to them, but beautifully caramelized down. We have 45 seconds. Okay. Now you see how quick that cooks. Lovely and tender. All that lovely fat straight into your sandwich. Like that. Break up your blue cheese. All over blue cheese and steak. Delicious. All right. 30 seconds. A little bit of watercress. Dress that with a little bit of olive oil. Okay. Tiny twist of pepper. A little pinch of salt in there. That, like that. Okay, 15 seconds. Onions in your sandwich. Yes, that is it. Timer is flashing. There we go. Come here, have a look at this. Close up there, Carol. Woo -hoo -hoo. Yes. Tom, thanks for asking me to do it. Uh, I think Jason Atherton nominated me. Uh, I'm gonna nominate the legend that is John Walton, uh, the group executive chef and chef patron of Mahe. Chris McClurk, the chef de cuisine of uh, number six. Um, Joe Rosier, uh, head chef, and Tom Dawes, both joint head chefs of the Mariners and Jack Clements from Reggiano's, Cafe Reggiano's, uh, to do this next. Boys, let's see what you can come up with. And uh, cheers, thanks for watching. <laughs>